The rapidly evolving digital landscape has given rise to new modes of conflict, with cyber warfare taking center stage in the strategic domain. The US Cyber Command and Russia's GRU cyber units are the embodiments of the cyber capabilities of two major powers, shaping the dynamics of electronic warfare. This article delves deep into their prowess, capabilities, and the implications of their operations. The integration of technology in military and strategic operations began during the latter part of the 20th century. Early attempts were focused on disrupting communication channels, gaining intelligence, and hampering adversaries' electronic capabilities. Over time, the scope has widened to include data breaches, influencing foreign elections, and damaging critical infrastructure. In this context, both the US and Russia have invested heavily in developing specialized cyber units. Their operations, often shrouded in secrecy, have had profound impacts both domestically and globally. US Cyber Command, Genesis and Growth Established in 2009, the US Cyber Command was conceived as a unit focused on defending the Department of Defense's information networks. However, its mission quickly expanded to include offensive operations, and by 2018, it had achieved full operational capability. Structure and Units The command's structure is built around specific cyber mission force teams, each with a specialized role in defensive and offensive cyber operations. Operations and Achievements Over the years, US Cyber Command has been involved in various operations, from countering ISIS's online activities to defending US elections. The command's agility and adaptability make it a formidable force in the cyber realm. Russia's GRU Cyber Units, Shadows of the Cyberspace The GRU, Russia's military intelligence agency, has been alleged to operate several cyber units. Although their existence isn't as openly discussed or acknowledged by the Russian government, their impacts are undeniably vast. Structure and Nature GRU cyber operations are notoriously covered. They operate in cells, making their activities hard to track and attribute. Operations and impacts. Allegedly, the GRU has been behind some of the most significant cyber incidents in recent years, from the attacks on Ukraine's power grid to the infamous DNC hack in 2016. Their tactics, techniques, and procedures often differ from other cyber actors, showcasing the unique approach to cyber warfare. Comparing capabilities, a jewel in the digital realm. Both the US Cyber Command and the GRU cyber units wield immense technical prowess. At the heart of the U.S. efforts is the development and deployment of custom cyber tools, many of which remain classified. However, occasional glimpses, such as the Stuxnet worm, reveal the depth of capabilities within the U.S. arsenal. On the other hand, the GRU, while perhaps not always employing the most advanced tools, excels in craftily leveraging existing tools and methods to great effect. The operational strategies of the two entities reflect their overarching national security philosophies. U.S. Cyber Command is steeped in a military tradition, with clearly defined chains of command, protocols, and rules of engagement. Their operations, though covert, still have the marks of a conventional military force, with mission objectives, collateral damage assessments, and post-operation analysis. Russia's GRU, in contrast, embraces a more guerrilla warfare style in the digital realm. Their operations, while sophisticated, often involve a level of deniability, making use of proxies, non-state actors, or embedding their operations within other seemingly benign activities. This approach not only offers them plausible deniability but also complicates Western efforts to pinpoint and counteract their activities. Every action in the cyber domain has ripples that travel globally. US Cyber Command's initiatives, especially their defensive measures, often benefit other nations by way of shared intelligence or through the fortification of global digital infrastructures, such as undersea data cables or international satellite networks. The GRU's cyber activities, meanwhile, often seek to disrupt the status quo. Their alleged interference in elections in the US and in Europe, attacks on critical infrastructure, and disinformation campaigns all aim to tilt the balance of power subtly in Russia's favor. The future of cyber warfare and electronic combat. The next frontier in cyber warfare is undoubtedly intertwined with emerging technologies. AI-driven cyber tools could outpace human hackers, launching attacks at speeds incomprehensible to human operators. Quantum computing, once fully realized, threatens to undermine current encryption standards, possibly rendering most current security protocols obsolete. For entities like US Cyber Command and the GRU, this presents both an opportunity and a challenge. The first to harness these capabilities will have a distinct advantage, but they will also need to defend against adversaries wielding similar tools. The interconnected nature of the digital realm means no nation can stand entirely isolated. In the face of increasing cyber threats, 
there is a growing acknowledgement that collaboration is essential. Even as rivalries persist, there are instances of shared intelligence to combat mutual threats, like global cybercrime rings or malware that threatens to spiral out of control. Additionally, as cyber warfare's consequences become increasingly tangible, the call for international norms and agreements grows louder. These might take the form of treaties, defining what constitutes a cyber act of war or establishing protocols for attribution and retaliation. In an era where battles are as likely to be fought in data centers as in physical territories, understanding the capabilities and intentions of entities like the US Cyber Command and Russia's GRU is paramount. As technology continues its relentless march forward, the strategies, alliances, and defenses built around it will shape the geopolitics of tomorrow. Conclusion The realm of cyber and electronic warfare is one of constant evolution. As the US Cyber Command and Russia's GRU cyber units continue to refine their strategies and techniques, the world will be intently watching. The outcomes of the digital jewels will not only shape the geopolitics of their respective nations but will define the contours of global security in the 21st century. As these entities move forward, they carry with them the hopes and fears of a world increasingly reliant on digital infrastructure. The next chapter in cyber warfare is yet to be written, but its implications are already profound. Until next time, take care.